At Audio Advice, we love the vinyl revolution. We started over 40 years ago in 1978 setting up turntables and we've never stopped. Now for those of you just entering the fun world of vinyl or those of you getting back into it, one item that may be a bit confusing is the Phono preamp. Now this is a critical piece to your vinyl setup, but it does have its technical side, which without a proper education can be a bit daunting. Now in this video, we'll first explain why you need a phono preamp, and then we'll conclude by recommending five great phono preamps that aren't gonna break the bank and come in underneath $500. A turntable is different than almost all other types of playback devices. A tiny stylus follows the modulations and record grooves, transmitting those little changes into the cartridge. Now the signal the cartridge produces from this is super low in level. It can be up to a thousand times less than what you would get from a CD player. Now obviously, if your amp or receiver has a phono preamp built in that's compatible with your table, you won't need a separate phono preamp. Some turntables also come with a phono preamp built in. Now the first thing you should think about is that there are two main types of phono cartridges, moving magnet and moving coil. Now as a general rule, most entry level to moderately priced tables come with a moving magnet cartridge. Moving coil cartridges have about 10 times less output than a moving magnet, meaning that they need a phono preamp capable of amplifying the even lower signal from a moving coil. However, these are preferred by audiophiles and music lovers because they are able to extract more information from the record grooves. When you are looking at phono preamps, you have probably come across a spec that talks about loading. This is the resistance the phono cartridge sees from the phono preamp. Now for almost all moving magnets, they want to see a standard loading of 47K. However, moving coil cartridges are all over the map and can vary from 1000 to 10 ohms in what is ideal for them, which depends on the individual cartridge design. Now that you understand what a phono preamp is and why you need one, let's take a look at our top phono preamps underneath $500. Now this was quite the task, as here at Audio Advice we have over 20 phono preamps to choose from, from under $500. Now keep in mind, prices in this video are subject to change, so make sure that you click the link in the description below to each product for the most current and up-to-date price. First up is the Project MM. Now Project Audio, based in Europe, is the world's largest manufacturer of turntables. They also make quite a few phono preamps as well. We feel the MM phono preamp is a great value for only $79. Now it is designed for moving magnet cartridges only. It has solid connections and is very low noise. Now the Project MM has dual mono circuitry, meaning each channel has its own circuit. This will give you great stereo separation. The MM will not add noise to the signal because of its well-shielded case and low noise circuitry. It is also very small in size and is able to hide behind your turntable if you wish to keep it hidden. Up next is the Cambridge Audio Solo. Cambridge Audio is one of our favorite brands at Audio Advice. Their home audio gear has a sound that really draws you into the music. It uses surface mount components and a switch mode power supply to further reduce noise. We also like the fact that it has a built-in subsonic filter that kicks in at 15 hertz, which is way below where 99% of speakers reproduce sound. Now sometimes a warped record or having your turntable too close to a full range speaker can cause this subsonic rumbling, which can be removed using this filter. Cambridge Gear has such a warm and engaging sound just like you get from a great vinyl album. We just feel closer to the music when we listen on Cambridge audio equipment. Moving up from that we have the MoFi Studio Phono. Now, Mobile Fidelity Sound Labs got started in early 1970s making their famous original master recordings, many of which are worth thousands today if you can find one. 
A few years ago, they launched a line of turntables, phono preamps, and phono cartridges to complement their great recordings. The Studio Phono is our first pick that can handle both moving magnet and moving coil cartridges. It offers a wealth of settings that should line up with about 95% of the moving coils on the market. You also get an adjustable gain, a mono switch, and a switchable subsonic filter. Another cool fact is that Tim DePerevicini, one of the most famous analog engineers out there, assisted with its design. This is our go-to model for people who want to explore moving coil cartridges or want a great moving magnet phono preamp. Next up is the Rega Phono MM. Now, Rega is one of our best-selling turntable brands here at Audio Advice as they cover the full spectrum all the way from entry level to state of the art. Now we included the Phono MM because of the engineering team at Rega specifically designed the Phono to be a perfect match to their great moving magnet cartridges we see on many of their Rega turntables. Although it's not feature packed, as it's a specific match for Rega moving magnets, it sounds warm and rich with lots of detail and separation. Plus, with moving magnet cartridges being so standardized, it also works great with any brand of moving magnet. This is the third revision of the Phono MM, which has already won many Best of European awards every year since the first version came out in 2014. Every one of Rega's products goes through rigorous listening tests to determine the best signal design, and the Phono MM is no exception. Finally, we have the Project Phonobox DS2. Now, the DS2 ranges in price from $399 all the way up to $499, depending upon the finish. And if you want a phono preamp you can grow with, the DS2 offers up a ton of options for adjusting it to match with a huge variety of phono cartridges. It will do both moving magnet and moving coil cartridges, and even gives you some fine tuning on capacitance adjustments for moving magnets. The neat part is the settings are accessed on the front panel so you can make changes on the fly while listening to hear for yourself the differences. Now we have found with moving coils going up or down one level will make a difference in the sound most people can easily hear. Going up usually makes things leaner while going down usually gets a little bit warmer. The dual mono design of the DS2 assures you of great separation, and we like the fact that Project spent time designing the chassis to be resistant to resonances. All right, this concludes our list of top phono preamps under $500. But keep in mind, as we said earlier in the video, Audio Advice has over 20 options of phono preamps in this price range. So there are tons of different options for you to explore. If you have questions on any of these products or any other audio gear, feel free to give us a call, chat with us on our website with one of our experts, or stop into our Raleigh or Charlotte, North Carolina locations. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this video and want to see more content like it, please subscribe to our channel. Our channel is dedicated to showcasing the best audio gear from brands around the world. We do reviews, comparisons, setup guides, and much more. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.